Hello, hello, my beautiful Pisces friends. I hope you guys are doing fantastic. Welcome to your energy update for the next little bit, Pisces. So Pisces, I feel a couple things for you guys, okay? I feel like uh, there's definitely some expansion in the works for you guys, okay? And I feel like you are really moving forward in some area of your life. I feel like you're, you know, really mustering up that energy, that strength. You, you have some new ideas in the horizons that you want to expand on. And there's an energy that could be in your surroundings that is not expanding. In fact, they see you moving on and it's almost like they want to cling harder, okay? And this energy for some of you, depending on how elevated or how evolved this person or this scenario who you're dealing with, it, it could get ugly. You know, this, this person could act out, okay, whatever situation you're in because um, out of fear, out of seeing you move forward, okay? Don't get caught up, Pisces, okay? Whatever you're expanding into is gonna be fantastic for you. It's gonna be new energy. You're putting your sights on new things. Don't get caught up, okay, with bottom of the deck, whatever king of cups type of energy that isn't really balanced in their emotions and they wanna act out, okay? Because they're feeling left out in the cold. I love these cards, right? So that's the that's underlying energy. So I do feel like that situation, whatever you're moving on from, because they see you um, and they've had some awareness of, you know, really recognizing your value and your worth, seeing you in, in, in you know, kind of expanding, moving forward. Someone might want to come back. Someone want, might want to, you know, keep you in, in a certain scenario, in a certain situation. And then I feel near future Pisces, you're really skeptical about it. You're really confused. You're not sure. You know, you're, you're kind of indecisive about it because, you know, you know where that energy left you. You know how you felt when you were dealing with that situation. And you're kind of at a crossroads between the old and the new. So let's see. Let's, let's see. Let's get a past, present, and future for Pisces. Past, present, and future for Pisces. Past, present, and future for Pisces. I do, I do feel that things are being exposed. People are being exposed. You know, the nastiness out of some people could just be coming out, um, you know, because there is nowhere to hide any, anymore, okay? These, these energies, these, this, this transition, this, uh, you know, how, the, how things are evolving is we, we can't hide anymore. It's coming to light to be addressed, okay? And whoever can't deal with it, um, you know, can't handle their emotions, hasn't done the work, they're going to be acting out, okay? But you don't want anything to do with that, Pisces, is what I'm feeling, literally. And um, just make sure, you know, you, you, you handle it. Don't let that hold you back. But let's see, past, present, and future for my Pisces friends. Past, present, and future for my Pisces friends. Past, present, and future. Sorry about that, Pisces. Something cut off. So let's see, past, present, and future for... My Pisces friends, past, present, and future. Past, present, and future. Let's see. Past, present, and future for Pisces. Past, present, and future for Pisces. Past, present, and future. Past, present, and future. Clear and concise message of spirit. What does Pisces need to know? Past, present, and future. Okay, bottom of the deck, six of swords, moving away from something, Pisces. Let's see, in the past, Pisces, we have the nine of wands, okay? You were wounded in a situation that was rough for you, okay? There was, it was a battle, it was a battle for you. And I feel like, you know, you had some sort of breakthrough, okay? Some sort of clarity that came in, um, you know, some sort of intel, okay? Some, some sort of uh, victory in some sense, okay, that came in for you and some new energy and maybe, you know, you started getting a lot more attention, okay? You started having these victories, the success, okay? Um, you know, after a, a long battle, okay? Maybe, you know, you were, had, uh, maybe if it was relationship situations for you, you were, you know, in, in a relationship that was tough or, or, you know, some hard times and you had some breakthrough to really focus on you, you focused in on work, having a lot of success, okay? If this is a work situation, um, you had some sort of breakthrough which allowed you to get the recognition and reward that you deserve. Now, present Pisces, high priestess, in your element here, intuitively getting some downloads, okay, really clear 
with yourself, okay? And you could be clear that the wheel of fortune is not turning in someone's favor, someone in your external, okay? As we kind of spoke. <laughs> Let's clarify, huh? Let's clarify. What is this wheel of fortune in the reverse? Could be a fire sign. Could be a fire sign. But I also feel here like Pisces, you are determined to move away from whatever stagnant energy, from whatever, you know, whatever you were resisting, whatever lessons, you know, were, you weren't learning, whatever felt like it was stuck, whatever you were resisting, you're, you're moving on from that. You were resisting something in the past, okay? You know, you kept going at it. Okay, another battle, let's go. And, and now, you're, you, you know, you're using your intuition and moving on from that. Again, bottom of the deck, the Six of Swords. Let's see what this King of Cups is in the reverse. What is this King of Cups? What is this King of Cups here? King of Cups. King of Cups here. King of Cups in the reverse. What is this King of Cups here in the reverse? Pisces present moment. King of Cups in the reverse. I think it's Three of Swords. <laughs> three of Swords, Pisces. So someone, okay, the wheel now is not turning in their favor, okay? This person has some sort of heartbreak, okay? That's what I'm telling you. For some people, this pain is acting them, let me speak. This, this pain for some people is making them act out, okay, in nasty ways for some of you. Again, it's gonna depend how enlightened, how evolved they are, okay? But this, this king of uh, a cups in the reverse, they're hurt, okay? They, they have some sort of hurt here, some sort of pain. They feel some sort of loss about you moving on, about you really, you know, gathering your power together, deciding to, to avoid the situation, okay? So Pisces, in the future, the sun for you, I do feel that this is the energy that you're going to be embodying, a lot of fantastic energy, um, you know, things are going to be illuminated even more so, okay? We have the queen of pentacles, you're going to be, you know, sitting on your throne there, okay? Very practical, I feel like you are merging your, you know, getting more practical than ever, okay? Merging with that spirituality, um, and you're focused on your financial success, that is your main Focus, you know, moving forward. It's like, let me focus on the things that I can control and, you know, focus on my success. And then the magician in the reverse could be dealing with a Gemini, okay? So someone here could be a little bit of a trickster now, you know, that you're illuminated. They're now want to find, do some trickery, to, you know, try to get you back here in some sense, okay? Or they feel like they just don't have all the resources to, to, to make something come about with you. Let's see. What is this magician in the reverse? Ten of Cups in the reverse and the Seven of Swords. So this person was deceptive in the past, okay? This person was self-sabotaging, okay? This person uh, was was deceitful, not a pretty sight, okay? They, they try to bamboozle you in some way, okay? And they really just took their own inner fulfillment and happiness away because now they're, they're realizing, okay, this person is, you know, has kind of... Um, stole from their own happiness, okay? This, this person is now, you know, feeling like things are out of reach, feeling like this Ten of Cups is out of reach, and they're now trying to, um, you know, look at things from a new approach, okay? I feel here like they are they are trying to, um, you know, they're definitely, you, the universe has definitely come in and made them see something, okay? Because they've, they've, been, they've been presented with this hurt in some way, in this situation, okay? And now, Pisces, it's like the roles reverse. Now you're here kind of enjoying your happiness, illuminated, um, great things coming in for you. And it's like, this is only the, the, the aftermath of their deceptive actions, okay? Of their sabotage. Wow. Let's, let's see here. Let's, let's clarify. Let's clarify. Uh, future, future for Pisces. What is this? Clarify all these cards, spirit angels, the guides, clear messages, sun, queen of pentacles, and then the seven of swords, a magician, and the uh, ten of cups, all in the reverse. What is this magician in the reverse? What is this magician in the reverse? What is this magician in the reverse? What is this magician in reverse? We have four. Universe and the the universe stepped in. Okay, universe stepped in. Things are not in their favor here. I feel like this is also like the wheel of fortune energy. Now the, things have kind of slowed down for them. Okay, the the, the universe has stepped into the situation. 
material harvest, which was in the reverse. Okay, I feel here like you're getting material harvest. You're getting the fruits of your labor here. Balance in the reverse and deception and envy, okay? So this person is now uh, really, you know, sitting in some pain. Again, the deception and envy, it, it's like it's it's brewing up for them, okay? they they Your success, I feel, okay? I do feel this envious energy. Your success, this person is not balanced. This person is not balanced. Your success almost infuriates them, okay? I'm feeling an energy of, 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 of this, this trickster here, this, 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 this person that is, uh, you know, in this current moment, you know, in the present, they, they, this person that is not balanced in their emotions, okay? They feel the pain. So when, again, depending on how evolved you are, if you can't deal with your pain, you have to inflict it on other people and just be nasty, okay? This could be someone that's currently in the situation, all right? But in the near future, Pisces, again, you're doing fine. You're illuminated in the happiness, okay? Sitting on your throne, your financial security here, okay? And someone here is really trying to rethink their approach, okay? They feel like things are out of reach with you. They feel like they, they effed up. They, 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 you know, their fulfillment, their, whatever collaboration here with you is not happening. The universe definitely stepped in for them, okay? And they're just being presented because, again, the universe, what we're going through, this, this, whole, this, 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 this whole transformation, this, this uh, ascension, okay, that everyone is going through and no one can hide anymore, okay? They're being presented with their feelings. You were literally a mirror for this person, okay? And it's, it's drawing out whatever feelings of, of envy, whatever, whatever inside of them, okay? Like, it, it's really being presented to them and it's like they have no choice but to address it. So for some of you, for a number of you, I feel like you could be dealing with a very nasty individual that just wants to inflict pain because that's how they feel. Current moment, okay? Watch out for that. But Pisces, I feel like the battle is already won here, okay? The light wins, absolutely. And as a matter of fact, you know, the light wins so much that they are rethinking their approach. They're, they're, you know, this, this person can't manifest. This person... This person cannot manifest. They're sitting here in, 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 in lack of fulfillment, feeling like their dreams are shattered, their life is not coming together, being very deceptive of your success about you know your material harvest because you put in the work. Don't like this person, whoever it is. <laughs> well, not that we don't like them, you know. We gotta be compassionate, compassionate towards them because they're... Hmm. Who is this magician? In the reverse, who is this magician in the broken heart? Yeah, this magician in the reverse is this little trickster person. They're just hurt. Don't get caught up. Don't get caught up. What else? Who is this magician? Could it be an earth sign. We have patience in the reverse, okay? I feel here it's someone that is not patient. <laughs> Someone that really can't control their, their their inner world, okay? We have the man holding a coin in the reverse. Again, it could be an earth sign here. I feel like their money is affected. Their money is most definitely effect, affected. Because now we're stepping into, more than ever, uh, the vibrational universe, okay? The, the universe is not responding anymore to the energies of the past, to the way things used to be, to the fully masculine. Now the feminine type of energies whether you're if you're female or male are arising what that means it's a, it's a vibration are you able to deal with your emotions are you able to work through that the universe is now responding more than ever to the vibration that you are emitting okay you are not able to hide anymore from from your inner work from the work that you didn't want to do you're now being presented head on okay you, you you can't hide from it you can't hide from it you feel it you you will not be able to hide from it until you deal with it Interesting. Let's see here. What is Pisces energy? And then we'll get the energy of the person you're dealing with. What is Pisces energy? Butterfly Pisces. Total transformation here. You are really blossoming. Like you, you were definitely in, in a cocoon here and you are you are stepping in to some of the best moments of your life here, Pisces. You've done the work there. It, I feel like, for, you know, it's been a couple of hard years, okay? I feel like, 
you know, you felt like, darn, it's been, it's been difficult. But Pisces, you're just honing for the best years of your life. You've, you've transformed into something beautiful here for everybody to see. I'm getting goosebumps. Like, very, very beautiful energy. What is the energy of the person that Pisces is dealing with? What is this magician in reverse energy? What is their energy? What is their energy? All right, let's see here. Mouse, dragon, and scorpion, okay? So someone that's really going deep within, okay? Someone that's being presented with, with, with their own deeper, deeper feelings here, okay? This, this, the dragon uh, is, is the energy of someone that is being presented, literally, you're, the, the universe is allowing you to see an objective view of yourself, okay? You're, you're seeing yourself through, through, through an objective view, okay? You're being presented with your own shadow aspects, okay? And this person is being a little nitpicky, almost a little small-minded, uh, small okay? It's, it's almost like making them nervous, nervous type of energy, nitpicky, uh, zoning in on the little details. It's almost like they're, they're, they're harboring. It's, 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 it's an energy, you know, the scorpion can sting themselves with how much resentment and how much, you know, things they harbor with inside, but they're being presented. Definitely the universe pre is presenting them with uh, the mirror of themselves. They're seeing themselves you know, how their part in the situation, how they did this to themselves, how, you know, they, they basically, you know, are not able to manifest. And I feel here like their mind is racing. Their mind is racing. Let's see here. Let's see here. Let's, let's wrap this up with, um, I haven't used these in a while. Some of these oracle cards, let's see. Soaring into joy. Childlike wonder fills your life, Pisces. Take an action. I enthusiastically embrace life's boundless possibilities. Pisces, you you did the work, Pisces. I'm telling you, you're about to enter a phase where you're gonna be very happy. New things are coming in for you. And whoever didn't do the work, Pisces, they're gonna be almost sitting in the shadow aspects, okay? You know, everyone is ascending. They're gonna have to do the work, but I feel here like you are going to soar, my dear. You are going to soar. Okay, and manifesting dreams. My dreams are coming true. You're manifesting your dreams, Pisces. You did the work. You should be very proud of yourself, Pisces. You are strong. You were, you were in that battle. You, you did the work. You, you didn't avoid it. You did the work, and now you're going to reap the rewards. But just be careful, Pisces, because there's people that are not as happy for you, okay? Protect your energy. Stay grounded. Um, don't feed into this negative energy that's being exposed and, and coming up. Let, let whatever energies are not of you, listen to your intuition. Let, let them stay where they're at. Avoid, avoid, because you don't want them to try to bring you down with their, with their, you know, those, those nasty feelings. Okay. So that's, th th this is the message I wanted to come through for you today. I hope it resonated for some of you, Pisces, take care of yourself. But Pisces, again, the battle's already won. This is you, the light that you are. Congratulations, and um, I'll see you guys later.